hello and welcome back to my channel Biaje here and in today's video we are going to talk about the best way to store or preserve ugu seeds ugu is also known as the fluted pumpkin and in cameroon we call it okongobong i have been asked by many of you what are the best ways to preserve this seed this very precious seed the ugu seed and i would like to share with you today how to do that and then show you how i do it Um, a tropical vegetable another name for it is the fluted pumpkin that is the common name for it the scientific name is Telferia occidentalis people in Nigeria call it ugu and those of us from Cameroon we call it okongobong this vegetable it's a precious vegetable it's a very important vegetable to most people especially from the southern parts of Nigeria and also people in Cameroon the southwestern part of Cameroon it's a very nutritious vegetable medicinal as well and we are here trying to grow it outside of the tropics so if you have uh, you have some seeds you're wondering how you can preserve the seeds until when you can grow the seeds you are in the right place because i'm going to share with you the best way to do that the best way to store to preserve your ugu seeds until you're ready to grow them but if you're new to the channel i'd like to say welcome what i do here is you know share my garden with you to inspire you to grow a garden i grow tropical indigenous african vegetable outside of the tropics and I share the lessons learned here with you so if you are interested in cultivating these very important african vegetables outside of the tropics go ahead and click on that subscribe button and also notification so that when i share videos about that on this channel you don't miss out on anything and to members of the tribe hello hello i see you all thank you all for your encouragement and your support now let's get into today's video all right so this video was inspired by one of the subscribers of this channel i was asked a question in the comment section on how to preserve the ugu seeds um, until she is ready to grow them in the spring i'm doing this video i'm recording this in december so growing these vegetables outside all of these tropical vegetables outside of the tropics really presents challenges to us because we have different seasons normally it is very cold in december a lot of the tropical vegetables will not tolerate frost so i understand so if you have your ugu seeds how can you preserve it until maybe it's warm again before you grow your seed beautiful question there's something i need to tell you about this ugu or the fluted pumpkin seeds it is a recalcitrant seed recalcitrant seed it turns out we have different types of seeds there are orthodox seeds and then there are what um, they refer to as recalcit recalcitrant seeds ugu is a type of recalcitrant seed what that means is it does not survive if the moisture content of the seed drops so as you dry the seeds and the moisture content drops i think it's about if it drops below 40 percent the seed is no longer viable you already see why that is a problem because you know if you preserve your seed outside of the pot once you break open the pot take out the seed and then expose it to air it is going to dry up and the moisture content is going to drop as the moisture content of that seed drops the seed is injured it will not germinate when the moisture content drops i think to below 40 percent now if you're thinking i can just put this in the freezer to preserve the moisture content freezing recalcitrant seeds also 
injures the cell walls of that seed and it will not germinate now i know it's not all doom in case you're thinking dang what do i do how do you then preserve the seed for long-term use the short answer is you do not if you have the seeds right now plant it right away plant it right away that's what i did i had some ubu seeds i looked for containers and then i planted the seeds and what you see here is a sprouted seed and i'm going to put these in containers and take my chances that way i'm gonna plant them in containers and then if it gets cold i will take it inside and do like that until it's spring and i can plant them directly in the ground so what you do with your ugu seeds if you have them please plant them right away this is my little setup my little uh fall ugu garden okay so as you can see i have transplanted my ugu plants i nurse the seeds in these containers and then move them into grow bags these are known as grow bags they are fabric pots very lightweight reusable if you want some i'm going to share a link in the description in the description box you can check it out i got them from amazon very highly recommended they will last forever so what i did was put some potting soil potting soil in here i mixed a little bit of chicken manure with the pot potting soil turns out that the fluted pumpkin or the ugu needs some of that nitrogen from chicken manure so you get composted the one that has been broken down already mix it here with the soil and then i planted the ugu here you can see this is already climbing as soon as i put them in these bags they are already climbing and i have it set up like this this is my makeshift greenhouse today is hot but whenever um, a frost or something like that is predicted i'm going to put a tarp over just some kind of a plastic plastic um thing over here to preserve heat or worst case scenario i can just i can cut the ugu move the plant indoors that way i preserve the plant and then when it is spring when it is warm again i can then take it to the garden and plant it directly in ground so let me show you how i did the transplanting of the ugu again my grow bag and in here is potting soil it is important that you get potting soil that is soil that is meant for use in containers please don't just get soil from your garden make sure it is potting soil okay it is important soil that you use in containers is going to be different from what you use in ground go to the store look for potting soil <coughs> excuse me so this is my ugu plant i'm going to get it out like so you can already see the roots down here so i'm gonna carefully put my open it up like so hold it down turn it upside down get it out okay nice see how the roots are nice okay now i'm gonna put it in the hole cover it look at that and that's it that's what i did for this one i'm going to go ahead and transplant all of the ugu this one is barely coming out look so this here is mulch cedar mulch i'm going to apply it around the base of my ugu plants it's optional but recommended what this does is helps to preserve moisture in the ground just looks better in my opinion looks better plus i'm hoping that it will form kind of a blanket to keep the ground warm 
in addition to helping with temperature regulation and aesthetics mulching also helps with weed control it helps to prevent weed from growing so tribe that is how i will store or preserve the ugu or fluted pumpkin seeds in the growing stage in the vegetative state not as seeds because if you preserve them as seeds they will dry out and dried out ugu seeds do not germinate the moisture content in them needs to be above 40 percent better still if it's above 60 percent for the seeds to germinate once you break them open from the pod the viability starts to reduce almost immediately so if you have your ugu seeds if you have the fluted pumpkin seeds go ahead and put them in the ground right now even if it's cold put them in the ground in containers put them indoors they will germinate but you can trim and keep trimming until when it is spring you take them outdoors and plant them in ground or just leave them in containers if you have the seeds of this very very uh, delicate vegetable go ahead and plant them right now i think that is the message i am trying to pass across thank you so much for watching i hope this was useful i hope it was valuable please go ahead and subscribe if you have not yet done so and go ahead and give this video a thumbs up grow a garden because when you grow a garden you do grow health until next time bye bye